All right, I'm going to put the chat away now. Everyone, uh, behave yourselves. Good spawn, good spawn, good spawn. Quite happy with that position going forth. Is this my bonus? What is this worth? I don't really play this map. Oh, absolutely. Let's be friends. Blizzards making this a little bit uh, interesting. Okay, Harley the Hawk's got a nice little start here. That's a plus five. So he's going to get plus five turn one. I want a good turn one bonus. Maybe if green. Oh, no, I'm going to go before green. Go away. Stop sending me hearts. You're getting a turn one plus three. Wait, red is the bot. Okay, so the red might be messing with my turn one plus three. Blue might knock me out here. Who was blue? Horace boy. No, don't knock me out. Not me too. Okay, I could take this one here, potentially. This is a plus four. And I can take it here. It is going to be split, but it should be okay. And then I can come through here. All right, phew. I saw it. Should I, should I reject his alliance? <laughs> no. I gotta be good. I can't be naughty. It would be funny. Ooh, bot also gets out of my, my second bonus. <laughs> I think I've got two, five. Oh God. Do I risk a three on one here? I got to. Come on. Nice. So I would like for this to be one bonus each. I got a little bit stressed watching the other games where it's just like all the bonuses, take everything, two bonuses each. It's just a bit stupid, really. I don't know. Not that fun, maybe. Or maybe it is. I, I kind of have a, a good start on this second bonus. You ain't getting that turn one. He's moving out of my third bonus, so kind. <laughs> um, am I the drama? Should I be the drama? Come on, move your stuff over. Go on with it. I'm feeling a little bit like being naughty in this. I never win these PLT games anyway, so I don't really care, honestly. This is, I just do this for, for lols. Unless it looks like I might win, then I'm very serious about the big maps open and it was the tournament I was really tryharding in all year. So what are you getting? Plus five, that's better than my plus four. Thank you. Accept my request. Finally. You're getting another one, aren't you? Blue. Blue gonna get a plus five and a plus three. Honestly, sickening greed. I would love to add to this uh this one over here and keep a position. But I'm just scared of the, the greeding out situation that I'm just gonna get knocked out of there.
So what do I do if I'm a little banana? Don't, don't, no. This is, the, no, 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 no. <laughs> he doesn't even do anything and I'm like, no. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Find another second bonus. No. I will hit it. If we're doing second bonuses, that's my second bonus. But we will see. Maybe we're not. Yeah, he's going to be defending this from the bot. So maybe he doesn't take it this turn. But that would be crazy because of course he is. He could take this two out. Let me give my shocked and appalled face. Where did that just go? Let's not act shocked about it because I did say thumbs down. So when we said we're picking on Little Banana Juice, the answer is yes. Every PRT game, I must target Little Banana Juice. Until he actually hates me. That's the goal. And I don't think he punishes me for it. He can't really get to me. I'll send him a heart. There we go. I'm not going to break his plus three. We're friends now. Yeah, and okay, he could, like, he could be working on this. I'm thinking that the honey pot... What's the, I don't know if there is really a honey pot. Everything's got a portal, so. Ooh, little banana mad, little banana angry. Little banana smash your three. <laughs> I think maybe he's trying to kill the bot or something. Yeah. Can I kill the bots?
Let's give it a go. No way. Seven to take out all of this? No. I'm an idiot. That can't be done. It was never possible. But I, I feed it to you, Green. Enjoy that bot kill. Have the points, spend the troops wisely. Let's be friends. Why is that oops? I think that's I think that's well played. I need a you're welcome text emote. I want him to think that I gave him that. <laughs> Oh, are you getting another bonus? No, you, the six is in the way. I think this could actually be a little banana bonus, right? Plus six, plus three. It's plus nine by my calculations. Does that mean I get another bonus? I don't want to be, I don't want to hold any less than the most. <laughs> Carlo is getting plus five. I'm getting plus eight. Blue is getting plus five. Green's getting plus five. Yellow's getting plus three. So if yellow takes, the, I'm currently holding the most. Yellow takes this, they're holding the most. And then I spam the shocked face and maybe someone breaks them. Plus six, seven, eight, nine. Maybe I take this plus five and give up my plus three. But then I, I mean, I'm in one position anyway. Blue's going to snag this one. Fair enough. Possibly I could have figured that out last turn when I was messing around with the bot. Five plus 10 plus 10 blue. What was I getting? Plus seven. You want me to attack blue? Um... I'm just gonna say I'm sorry. And then I'm gonna say attack black. I'm gonna let him know it was black's idea. Very sneaky. Okay, he gets it, he gets it. I don't know if he does, but. <laughs> uh, what am I doing here? Send him a heart, send him a heart. Tell him it was, it was Harlow, it wasn't me. I didn't want to do it. He really, he forced me into it. <laughs> Is that going to work? Um, why am I working together with Harlow who is now like the weakest? I don't know. I should probably try and work with the strongest. Why don't you go through yellow into blue?
Wait, Blue also has that bonus. Blue actually had plus 13. Okay, I feel less bad about it all. What, that was not, that wasn't doing anything. That did nothing. Blue and I are generating the same amount, actually. I am trusting that Twitch chat is behaving themselves because I'm not looking at it, but I do just keep pulling up the YouTube chat. Like no one is talking in there, but I worry that there's no mod. And Tom is watching the wrestling, so he's definitely not modding. Oh, what's the plan here, Blue? What do you want? I'm going to say it. I don't want anyone else having this bonus. And it looks like no one's taking that. And... That'll do. See, maybe people see this differently, which is usually the way when I'm looking at a game and I'm I'm thinking, oh, I th I'm in quite a good position here. My fear is that if I went and rewatched the PRT broadcast, they're there like, oh, oh, what's she doing? What's she doing? Oh, she's crazy. She's going to lose. But I think it looks fine. I don't know who do we kill. Like, am I taking a kill? Obviously, little banana is looking a little uh, on the weak side, but that won't be for long with them holding this big bonus. This is a very big bonus for them to hold and guard from here. Ooh, little banana feed, D little banana something, something happened. You just hit yellow. No, you didn't, you hit blue. I don't know what they're doing. Actually, I guess Harlow the Hawk is the weakest, right? They're holding the least. And green. Green and black. I'm not very familiar with this map or these bonuses, so it's kind of hard for me to, as someone who doesn't pay attention to anything. It's hard for me to see what everyone is getting. They are getting the biggest trade, so. Should I dab for 69? I'll be that person. That's me. <laughs> I was really hoping that Blue would... Uh, pick on black after I, I dobbed in Harlow for <laughs> telling me to him. Am I allowed to keep this stack here then? It looks like it, but I don't know.
This is kill guarded. I don't think he takes that five, honestly. I think he's crazy if he does. I'm not going to block up this one here in case someone wants to come through and they hit my nine. Because I don't want to put so many troops here that I'm really... And then someone would come through and hit blue. I don't know. I feel like I don't need to. I've got access to this territory, honestly, through yellow if I really want to get in here. I'm on 68. What a missed opportunity. I shouldn't have taken a card. Okay, second round of trades. Trade on three, let's go. Uh, hopefully I... I'm gonna have to use my wild. Unless I get another dude. Mm, are you gonna knock me out of here, Black? I'm not sure what's happening. Like... Don't hit my three, or what's your plan here? What are all the threes for? And what's this five doing? I could trade on three to ensure I'm not first out, but then it really hinders my chance of winning. But are yellow or blue gonna take me out? I mean, anyone could, couldn't they? It's not, not that hard to kill, but no one really is with the portals. I saw it too. I wasn't going to be immature, but <laughs> I guess we must. <laughs> Risk players are absolute dweebs. We're all so strong that for a 20 trade, no one is going to be worth killing. I was punished last round in the big maps open for using Alliance chat and trying to orchestrate kills and work together. It ended up getting me killed because I was stabbed in the back, which I'm definitely over. Um... So, like, a big part of me is, like, whatever, I just won't get involved. If someone wants to work with me, then they can. Why? What is the seven doing? Does he think the seven connects to this one, maybe? I don't understand, like... Why would you ever want any of your troops tucked away where they can't be used? Says me with the six back here, but. Okay, trade on four, Lil Banana trade. Can Lil Banana kill me? Definitely. It's not really worth it, but if you want to. More concerned about blue. But blue doesn't have much on a portal and they're getting 25. So they'd have to put everything they've got onto a portal to hit this. 
It's 15 could come out for the nine. 25 to take care of the rest. Oh no, then they can't get to this. I don't think blue's got me. So what am I getting? I'm getting a 30 trade. Um, to kill green. Might be worth it. You're killing someone, Blue, aren't you? Should I kill Black? Do I have enough? Okay, there's some points. I don't know if I survive after this. <laughs> it's probably a horrible idea. I'm not chaining it anywhere, because now I'm pretty weak. The game is progressing though, like whatever. I got some points, I progressed it. And we, you know, this is what's gonna happen in these games where if we're taking two bonuses each, then the kills are not really going to be worth it the second round of trades. Don't know if I survive now. Probably not. I mean, green could kill me, but then they're sat on five cards. And the trades are still 45. Yeah, I probably die here. I died to one of these two. Can they get to me though? I'll send you a thumbs up for that. Enjoy your second bonus. Plus nine. Does anyone break my new accidental bonus? <laughs> so this 40 could, he could add to this, kill this 40 and these. But this 44, he's, no, he'd go through the portal and then through everything else. A little bit awkward to get to these two though. I think it's possible. It's it's risky. Okay, blue. Bit stronger than yellow. Positioned better to kill me. Still does not have enough on a portal to get to the 40. I die for four cards though. I don't have a trade on three, which I really needed. I need you to keep me alive. I need you to kill guard me. I don't know how to communicate to kill guard me here. A heart. Uh, or to kill guard me here. That's fine. That's fine. No. No. Okay. Well, at least I got hold of this bonus. That's kind of cool. Oh, 
<laughs> I'm not surviving this. I'm not surviving it. There's no shot. Hundred and forty. Uh. Why do I never have a trade on four? This has happened to me in so many tournament games. I don't know if I survive this anyway. I don't know. One hundred and twenty-nine to kill me. Yeah, with the trade. But then you're ending on five cards if you kill me. Which is a bad idea. But you, and, I mean, I don't have the trade anyway, so it doesn't matter. I was going to die. But surely they just go out next. Thumbs down. Could it get any worse? Dying to the little banana juice. Exactly. My enemy. Chat's back up. What do we think? Oops. Killing you to not set was a weird choice. Yeah, absolutely. I agree. It didn't matter, but they he doesn't know that I didn't have the set. So I'm really unbothered because I wasn't winning that. As, as soon as I had no set, I was dead anyway. And probably, yeah, what a feed. What a feed. All right. Green gets the win on this game. Yeah, I would say that I had bad card luck because this little banana kill made no sense. If he knew I had no trade, which obviously he didn't, um then it was actually kind of a good choice because at least he got a kill <coughs> and higher placement. Yeah, so he's going to take out most of blue now to make it a bit easier. If I had a trade on three, I could have killed green. Yeah, for sure. So many things I could have done if I had a trade on three, but I didn't even have the trade on four, so it's whatever. This is, this is my usual luck, having no trade on four. This has happened to me so many times in tournaments with progressive settings. But yeah, for Lil Banana, it was actually the right call, as it turns out for them. Because I fumbled it. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> yeah, they trade. I still don't think it's going to be enough. Pathing is tricky with the blizzards as well. Hello, Chris. Uh, do they have a shot? Look, if it was a random ranked game, I would say sure. You know, for pathing and speed, but look, these two are both really good. This is Grim Shanky in green, Horace Boy in blue. Grim Shanky is 
two cards ahead and what was it like 90 troops ahead he's got this I would go up here, yeah, and then finish in the portal. Yeah, Grim's great. But they were fed the game. But they, you know, whatever. Angry. Angry face. I didn't get time to throw the angry face in. All right, we'll join for the interview. Congratulations, Grim. Yeah. Hey, great job, Hot Buns. I, I didn't expect you to get killed there. I thought you played great. Thank you. I didn't have the trade on four anyway, so I'm unbothered. If it wasn't then, it would have been soon oh, after. Oh, shit. Hot Buns, we were like, what the hell's he doing? She's got to be so pissed off right now. No, I, I didn't have a trade on four, so who cares? <laughs> it was, yeah. I wasn't going to last long after okay. that anyway. But yeah, I did uh, yeah. think that that was a... Uh, a strange kill to make but actually knowing that i had no trade on four it was actually the right choice for banana because they got placement and a kill and someone whoever was after me would have got the win because i'd been on five cards so yeah so it looked like most of you um needed at least eight eight or nine points to move on to the next round um so i think uh so hoppins you got nine harlow you got four so you're good you're at 16. Hot ones, I believe you're at 18. Horse boy now at 16. Little banana at what? Uh, 19, I think. And Grim Shanky obviously getting the win, so he's moving on. So this whole group goes from n only one moving on maybe to uh, everyone moving on probably. Oh really? Yeah, we all did well what played. we needed to do. I nice. think so. I mean, unless unless it goes to 17, in which case, horse boy and Harlow are fucked. But <laughs> I think the cutoff's going to be 16. So. We might oh, have a few ties, on. but that's why everyone will move on. We're not going to cut anyone. So, how do you guys feel about uh, about the game? You guys like that it turned into a two bonus game? Were you were you okay with that? Did you think about breaking? Uh, I did, I broke. Who was blue? Horus oh, boy, I think. I oh, broke. Yeah, I, I I was having oh, yeah. fun with this game. I was just sort of laughing. I wasn't taking this too seriously. I broke Horace Boy. I didn't even realize they had three bonuses. I thought they had two when I broke. So I was kind of apologetic in Alliance chat. I tried to blame it on Harlow. I wasn't right. sure if it worked. I, w I wasn't <laughs> expect to keep it anyway. <laughs> yeah, he got a little greedy there with the plus three bonuses. Well, I was going to go for, I was going to take that one after if he didn't. I was going to try the go extra greedy strat and see what happened. So, so Actually, early on, Buns, did you have any thought to go for that plus five next to you, the one that Horace eventually took, instead of taking the plus three next to Banana? Uh, I don't know. There, there was only a few troops in there. Or did you, you just had your eye on that plus three and nothing was stopping you there, I guess? I guess. I'm not that familiar with this map, so I think I'd sort of eyed up that plus three and sort of made that decision. Yeah. And uh, I guess I didn't really think it through. I, I, did, I definitely did talk about that plus five after I already had my plus three, because I was going to take the plus five and give up the three but by that point it was too late and horace took it but also then i was very close together all my troops it was it doesn't make that much difference i don't think with the portals but i don't know that was something i was aware of that to have my two bonuses next to each other well so i'll say, say this oh sorry go ahead i, I was gonna say i i would say in every practice that i did pe people who greeted out for bonuses too much ended up getting punished for it mm. so there's kind of like almost a there, there's like a sweet spot that you want to get like like a plus six to plus seven total i think and anything above that the board tends to turn on you we i think we played an extreme version of good neighbor here for the most part except for in horace's case yeah i knew it would be good neighbor though i didn't do any practice but i watched the other games and I, I well, knew I think roughly how this player, was going to go. Good neighbor can work a little easier. I think if there's a six player there, someone might get a little jealous, right? Yeah. Um. So Harlow, we saw that you did not have a trade on four there at the end, so yeah. you were screwed either way. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for so, showing that. 
I, I wanted to, I wanted to show that because my my attitude right now is like I I was dead anyway. It might as well be in hot buns. I don't mind the pink player killing me when that's yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Uh, it was a last minute sure decision. Was I wasn't really that. paying attention. I was like, oh, wait, I've so, got this kill. <laughs> yeah, we weren't yeah. sure if you were going to go for it or not because it was, you know, it was a decent amount of troops for just like, I think, a 30 trade at that point. Yeah. Back. yeah. Yeah. But I think it was, it was good enough. You got good enough dice that you didn't, yeah. you know, you were like 20 troops behind everyone after the kill. So it wasn't too bad. And, and, and that was my, if I, if I would say that, uh, that I made a mistake on this game was that I, I knew that I had to remove that position from the bottom. But I decided I decided to say to make the statement to Blue that we were not going to let him hold. And yeah, that was game. But anyway, it doesn't matter because if Hot Ones didn't kill me, Horace Boy would have killed me anyway. Yeah, yeah I mean obviously you you don't trade there and you get and you get killed. So Lil Banana, I'd like to ask you, so what was your thought there when you killed Hot Buns for no trade? What was going through your mind there? Um I don't know. It it was a risky move, I would say. Uh, but but the thing is, it, it would guarantee me solid points. And there was also potential of um, me surviving the next round. Um, and then I'll have a set uh, because I will be on five cards. Because, um, I mean, I, I, I'm not in... I can't exactly remember how many troops I lost in terms of rolls. But uh, I was thinking that I might be able to survive. Um, if they don't have a 7-3. Um, so it's a chance that I was willing to take. And if I did end up dying, it was solid points um, that I could have. I think you made the right decision, but for the wrong reason. I don't know if you were in here when I said I had no trade on four anyway. So had you not taken it, you wouldn't have got the points for the kill. And whoever was after me would have just killed me for five cards anyway, and then probably swept the game. So at least you got a kill and a higher placement. Yeah, it worked out in the end for you, for sure. Um, I think you you got enough points now to move on, for sure. Now, Horace Boy, speaking of killing someone on five cards, you kind of gave up the, the kill there on Banana. Did you just feel like you couldn't make it in time? or? Yeah, exactly. I, I, I'm no Mumba. I, don't, <laughs> I cannot sweep a board that fast. And when I realized it, I wouldn't have time. I stopped. Okay. Yeah, think... that's fair. I, I I was I, I was, uh, you know I'm I'm not I'm not framing I'm recording only this game and I was mentioning that out loud that you were in a strong position but you you had like three different stacks three different smaller stacks and I thought that was going to bite, bite you in the behind and that's what I think it did because now you have to coordinate that team in that big stack of yellow so you can get the kill, so, so yeah I think that I think that was the biggest thing that hurt you at the end. Yeah, that was definitely. Much the and I, I didn't expect uh, yellow to go that hard all over the board. So I had only a few seconds to adjust. <laughs> so, okay, <laughs> I'm going to do this. How do I proceed? And uh, yeah, I hesitated a little, a little bit too much. 